So I don't know if this is something you've thought about, something that's up for debate, but I am all for people taking like a legitimate staycation because I don't think traveling is like a real big thing right now. Yeah, let's talk about it. Welcome to Random Wednesdays on Gratified Grad, where it's my goal to help you graduate with gratification. I'm Leticia, and in today's video, we're going to talk about taking a vacation during quarantine. Um, I'm all for people taking a little bit of a break, right? Like we are coming at the end of school years, end of the academic school years. We are... Um, coming upon times where people would normally just take a vacation. So, um, I know for myself, uh, I was supposed to take like a week vacation in April and, um, that's when everything started popping with the virus. So <laughs> my travel plans got canceled. Um, and so because of that, I kind of just kept working. And then, uh, like last week, I started to feel like I need a break. Um, but you know, it wasn't like really, really like m making me feel like I needed to take a break. Uh, this week, oh yeah, no. Um, my, my body has said, take a break, take it easy. Like, so. And I've worked hard, not like I haven't been doing any work. Like I've been pretty productive during this quarantine. So I am taking my staycation. Um, so what is a staycation? What does that look like, right? A lot of people, <laughs> a lot of graduate students, let me um, clarify, specify that. A lot of graduate students, you know, I'll be like, oh, so, you know, how are you doing? Um, are you taking frequent breaks? Uh, how are your weekends look? Do you have, you know, set start and end times for your work day? You know, what is just your routine and your normal life like? And um, some of them are like, oh, yeah, yeah, I took a break. I'm taking breaks. And I'm like, are you taking real breaks? Or um, are you still checking your emails? Are you still trying to analyze data? Are you bringing, you know, let's say you want to go outside and sit on the patio. How are you spending that time on the patio? Like, are you reading papers? Like, stuff like that. So you have to give yourself, like, breaks. Even, even if this is something that you love, right? You're thoroughly in love with your research. You're thoroughly in love with your work. You need a break. So, take a break, um, even if it's just for a day, because I also know that during this time, it can, it can make you feel a little guilty for just, like, taking a day in the middle of the week to not do anything or to just, you know, lay around and watch um, Netflix or YouTube all day, but, like, those days are just as valuable as the days that we're working like you need brain breaks you need time to process and like let stuff mull over in the back of your mind and let it process and simmer so that you can get new ideas so take that staycation um i know like i was looking at my facebook memories and two years ago i took a 10 hour hike That was the first 10 hour hike I ever did. But yeah, I took a 10 hour hike. And so I'm like, oh, maybe I should do that again. 